Jomo Kenyatta University of Agriculture and Technology held its annual Tech Innovation Expo which ended today. Our very own David Kagina was there and will be highlighting some of the most outstanding innovation at the expo. On today's highlight, he focuses on a mini tractor motorbike that is meant to offer tilling solutions to small scale farmers, enhancing efficiency and productivity at an affordable cost. Let's take a look. Now, with most innovations comes the desire to solve a problem in the society. With me right here is a mini tractor motorcycle. And joining me is the innovator, the man and the brains behind this project. Maybe you can introduce yourself and tell us what problem are you trying to solve with this innovation? Yes, my name is Jefferson Kitabe. I'm pursuing strategic management. The mini tractor is an invention we came up with with my friends, Peter Zioki and Ian Mutisia. Our bike is modified for the purpose of adaptability and high power output that will enable small scale farmers to actually do small scale farming activities at their land and uh, cut short the time that they need to farm. So this one is coming to replace the tractor for the small scale farmers? Yes, that, uh, that is the point. We are looking for a cheap alternative that is going to be suitable for all small Kenyan farmers. And, uh, how we're going to improve on the cost and uh, reduce on the time that they need to team land. That is quite a huge task for a normal motorbike. So what are some of the adjustments that you've done to your, uh, to your bike? Yes, so as you can see, we have disc brakes instead of the normal disc cylinders you'll find on motorbikes. Mm -hmm. We have improved the intake and exhaust valves in, in the bike. We have also mounted a racing exhaust with carbon fiber endings to reduce noise pollution. Now we've also worked on improving the torque and the compression ratio. Modern standard bicycles, or not bicycles, motorbikes, have a 9.61 ratio, and ours works at a 11.5.1 ratio. Okay, and I also see uh, your shock absorber is quite different from the normal bike. Yes, we're using a single racing monoshock mm -hmm. for the bike. It increases the, it reduces the light and increases the power output for the bike too, as and stabilize it during farming activities. Well, the farm is quite messy in terms of soil and terrain. Yes. Uh, are the wheels different? The, the wheels. The wheels, yes. The wheels are different. As you can see, we're working with five to six millimeter inch tires for the rear and also the front too to increase better traction for the bike. Okay. Yes. Beautiful. Thank you. And that is quite a problem solving innovation right there. I'm David Kagino. That's all for today.